Whale sells 10 billion Pepe. Price prediction as Pepe plummets 8%. Simon Chandler last updated July 3, 2024 at 1921 GMT3. Three minutes read. Pepe has fallen by 8% today, dropping to your point of his early zones of on $5.8 after a whale dumped 10 billion on Pepe and provoked a sell-off. The Ethereum-based meme coin is now down by 16% in a week and 30% in a month, although it holds on to a big cuff that earned an 11% gain in the past year. Its losses over the past few weeks may be disappointing, but they put the coin in a strong position to rebound, and given that the same whale still holds. There's still an expectation that it will see more gains in the not-too-distant future. Whale sells 10 billion price prediction as Pepe plunges 7%. Pep has taken a big hit today, yet the flip side of this is that it has entered an oversold position, which usually implies an incoming recovery. It's particularly evident with its relative strength index, purple, which has dropped all the how it ends today as holders race to sell. Also declining is the coin's 30-day moving average, or she is falling further below the 200-day blue, an end to the point where it really is to come back up. It will be interesting to see whether the coin support level, green, can prevent a fall below 0.000 zones or $5, especially when it has fallen by 2% in the past hour. If it can prevent a further drop, it may rebound quickly. Of course, as noted above, whales seem more likely to sell Pepe than buy it right now, with the offloading of 10 billion Pepe by long-term holder dimethyltryptamine it has potentially a bad sign. On the other hand, the tweet also notes that the same whale still owns around $21.9 million in the meme token, and they're unlikely to dump it all at once, given that it would hurt the coin's price and, by extension, their potential takings. Also positive is the fact that Pepe has reached highs more recently than many other alts and meme tokens, having set a new ATH of $0.0001717 as recently as May 27. It therefore has good medium and long-term momentum, potentially enough to recover strongly again in the next few days. It may also receive a boost along with the rest of the market very soon. Once the first Ethereum ETFs launch in the USA, realistic target for it is $0.000012 in the next few weeks, and then $0.000015 by the end of August. New high potential alternatives. As Pepe navigates through a mine and downturn, it may make sense for some traders to explore other options. This strategy aims not only to sidestep potential losses, but also to capitalize on several newer coins that are showing signs of a significant rally in the near future. A great example of this comes from the new Layer 2 project, Pepe Unchained, which has raised an impressive $2 million in its ongoing pre-sale. Pepe Chain is exciting investors because of its strong fundamentals with its L2 platform offering instant transactions and extremely low fees. This will make it arrive to existing Ethereum-based Layer 2 networks such as Base, Optimism, and Polygon. Because it offers stronger scalability and efficiency, it will also be able to offer holders double the staking rewards it would have offered as a normal Ethereum-based token. This provides investors with a greater incentive to hold the token over the longer term, with the coin having a cap supply of 8 billion pepu. It is reserved 30% of this for taking, with 20% allocated to the pre-sale, 20% to marketing, 10% to liquidity, 10% for its team, and 10% for chain inventory. Also encouraging is the coin's Greg Lay expanding community. With its X account now having 400 followers and its Telegram channel boasting 2,600 subscribers. This is a nice early sign of its potential popularity, something which is vital if it's to have a long-term future. Investors can join its pre sale by heading over to the coin's official website, where they can buy Pepu using other ETF, BNB, USDT, or fiat currency. Given how popular its pre sale has been so far, it may rally vigorously once it lists in the next few weeks. Buy Pepu now. Follow us on Google News. Disclaimer, crypto is a high-risk asset class. This article is provided for informational purposes and does not constitute investment advice. You could lose all of, of your capital.